This week, we will study the parts of a bug's body and create an accurate drawing using symmetry. Remember, when something is symmetrical, it means both sides are the same. You will choose from one of these three insects to draw. Begin by getting a piece of paper, a pencil, and your oil pastels. Next, set those aside and make sure your paper is vertical. Then you're going to fold it in half so that it's long and skinny like a hot dog bun. Open it back up and we will create our drawing on only one half of the fold. Since we are showing symmetry, we're going to draw half of our insect and then make a print of the other half so that it matches. You're going to take a look at the three insects I have provided anatomy charts of. Choose one and begin drawing half of it. Half of it. You want to make sure that you draw it big and include all the parts of the body. Think about the head, the abdomen, the thorax, segmented legs, wings if you choose the moth. So pay attention to all the different body parts and use your pencil to draw half of your insect on your paper. I will put the insects back up now so that you may pause the video on whichever insect you choose to draw. Keep watching to see all the steps. Once you have finished drawing half of your insect's body with your pencil, get your black oil pastel and trace over all of your pencil lines. When you are doing this step, make sure that you are pressing down very hard so you get a nice thick layer and also make sure you go over each line two times. Once you have finished tracing each line two times with your black oil pastel, fold your paper in half and use the side of your fist to rub, rub, rub. You want to make sure you're really generating some heat so your hand's going to feel warm. You want to make sure you're pressing hard and rubbing everywhere. Once you think you are done, open it up and check to see if you can see all of your lines. Now you're going to take your black oil pastel and just trace over those lines creating a perfectly symmetrical match. Take a photo of your progress so far and submit it to Canvas. Save this to be colored next week.